This is The Space. I'm your host, Casey Donovan. It's time to reflect on the week and take it easy for your Sunday with one of my favourite tips from the last seven days. So relax, get comfy, and let's do this. Today we're talking about the social network effect. No, that's not the anxiety we feel on Facebook. It's the name researchers have given to the impact our friends and family have on our love life. And it turns out, it's a lot. This episode was inspired by a TED video titled, Should You Care About What Your Parents Think? Researchers used to believe that disapproving parents would drive us towards a romantic partner. Think Romeo and Juliet. But new research suggests we do care about our friends' and family's approval. When our social network likes our date, we feel more love, commitment, and more positive about a partner. It's interesting because in other areas of our lives, we love to rebel. When someone tells us to lower our voice, we yell. When someone tells us to spend less money, we go splurging. But when it comes to matters of the heart, we're happier to outsource our opinion. Why does this matter? Well, it could help you in the pursuit of love. If you do want to chat to family and friends about the person you met, be aware of the impact their opinion could have on you. It might be worth getting less opinions, especially in the early days. If you do go looking for advice, be aware of your own gut feeling. We all want our friends to love our lover, but be aware of peer pressure, especially when it comes to romance. What if your mum hates your new person? You might elope, that'll show them. There is a way to rebel in more conscious ways. Researchers call it independent reactance. We can rebel by ignoring our family's concerns and just make the best choice for our situation. Doesn't that sound sensible? The moral of the story? We do want our mates to raid our date, but we can still override their opinion. I'm Casey Donovan, and this is The Space. Thanks for taking the time to learn about this mindfulness stuff. It's cool to have you here. See you tomorrow. Space out.